Hello all, welcome back. Now in this video, I will show you how to delete an item from linked list. So now in this example, I will show you how to delete the record of a student in a linked list. So you can just simply copy this line and you can paste over here. And this is the option number 8. Now you can say that delete from any position. So now in the case number 8, I want to just write the case 8 and here I want to just change the name of the function and the name of the function is that is delete by position. Now you can just simply copy the code of that is search by position. So you can just simply copy the code of search by position and you can paste over here before main and instead of this is a search by position you can just make it here that is a delete by position. Now here you can just say that that is enter position to delete. You can get the position if it is greater than n then index out of bound. But if the index is not out of bound then what you want to do and what if user want to delete the position at the one. So let me remove this particular code and I'm just writing here else if position equal equal one. It means that if the position is one then definitely I need to remove the head and I need to make the changes into the head that the next to the head will become the head. So here you can just declare one more variable over here and that is a student pointer temp. And here you can say that temp is equal to that is head. And you can say that head is equal to that is head dot next. So what happened? The head data will be stored into temp and head will become the next of the head. So now you can simply release the memory of temp. So the first node will be deleted. So you can say that this is the code to delete from first position. But what if the position is that is not greater than n. So here you can write one more condition and that is else if position is greater than 0. It means that if the position is greater than 0 but it is not greater than n. So definitely it means that I want to delete the record from any position and that can be a, any position in between the list. So here you can just simply write the loop that is for i equal to 1, i less than position minus 1, i plus plus. And here you can simply iterate the list that is h equal to h dot next. So my cursor will be at the previous record before the delete. It means that if the user want to delete the position number 5, then my cursor will be at the fourth position. So you can do what temporary is equal to h dot next. It means that if you want to delete the fifth node, then fifth node will be stored into the temporary. Now you can say that h dot next is equal to h dot next dot next. So one node will be bypass and you can simply write free temp. And here you can just print the message that is record deleted successfully and here you can just copy this and you can write the same message over here and you can say that the head is deleted successfully now you can save this now you can build and run this particular code and you will get the result now here you can just choose the first option for example one create the list 101 name of the person for example, Kapil Shukla and the percentage is 65. Let me add one more, 102, Devan Patel, percentage for example, 82. Let me add one more, 103 and the name of the person for example, Tatsat Shukla, percentage for example, 81. You can display the record, there are three records are there. Now I want to delete the record from the first position. So you can just write 8 and 1 so record will be deleted successfully and you can see that the first record Kapil Sukla is deleted. Now you can add the record for example I want to insert at the any position that is 5 
and I want to insert at the position number 2 and the record is that is 99 and the name of the person is for example Sandeep Ramani and you can add the percentage for example 92. So there are three records. Now I want to delete the record from last that is 103. So you can use the option age and you can write position number 3. So that record will be deleted and there are two records available. Now you can delete the record and that is 2. So second record will be also deleted. So this is the way you can write the code to delete the item from the link list. So that's it from my side. If you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.